In this Pictory review, I'm going to be going through all of the features and everything you need to know about this software. But first, you might be asking what Pictory is. Pictory uses AI to easily convert long form video and text content into short branded videos for social media. In other words, it will save you a ton of time when it comes to video creation. Pictory has four unbelievable features that you are going to love if you're into creating videos with speed and ease. Pictory are currently offering a lifetime deal over at Sumo so go ahead and type in clicky.info slash pictory and you'll be able to see a buy now button and you can get this deal for $59 which will get you lifetime access to the premium plan edits up to 20 minutes all the premium features that you would get and also premium licensed images and videos from Shutterstock which is a big win plan I went with was licensed tier 2 because I don't see myself creating more than 60 projects per month if you want unlimited everything basically Basically, license tier three is definitely a big win. Let's jump into Pictory and start going through all the features. First thing you're going to see is all of those features I just mentioned, followed by my project, brand settings, and help. Let's go ahead and start off with article two video. We're going to want a blog post, so I'm just going to go to the NHS website on a healthy eating blog, and I'm going to paste that in and click proceed. On the left, you've got the source article, which shows all the main components of the article with a few things stripped back, and then on the right it's got the stripped version of the article so it's not got any heading tags or anything on those lines you can actually click any part of the source article so for example this sentence here and it will remove it from the stripped article over here or you can click it again and it will bring it back when you're happy with this go ahead and click next and it's going to ask you what format you would like to be rendered in or created in we're going to pretend we're uploading this to youtube and click this now it's already created a full-blown video for us you can see it's got all the animations in it's found the videos for us and it's even added the text in a nice font with backgrounds on it and as i click the next scene buttons it's moving to each scene so for example you can see i'm on scene eight if i click this it moves on to scene seven you can also quickly navigate between each scene by clicking these little thumbnails here and on the left you have all your customization options if you want to insert a scene you would go over the plus icon and simply click so for example if i want a blank scene in it will open up this library of options and customization and solid color or if you want to change it to library you've got a library of stuff where you can actually uh, research the specific topic you can even upload your own stuff click the story tab and scroll down and you can see that's where the blank scene is you can delete the scene by clicking it and then clicking the delete button and press yes and then that's gone another thing you can do is just by clicking on each scene you can edit anything in the scene the text wherever you want double click it you can actually change the text if you desire by clicking on audio will show you all the music you can incorporate by simply clicking apply and you have your other tabs for your robot style voiceovers or you can upload your own stuff by clicking on audio settings you can change the background music volume so if you want the voiceover to be louder you'll just customize the background music here and then under the styles tab this will change the overall theme of the video so different animations etc so for example this one now that's automatically be done and you can see right here the animations changing like so under the format option you can of course change the format to any of the other formats that you want and then when you're done you can either do save preview or generate let's go ahead and do preview and now it's showing you a preview of the video under the generate option you have three options the first one is the video which will just generate the video the spreadsheet of social video posts will download all the relevant information into a spreadsheet ready for you to upload into your social media management platforms and thirdly it integrates directly with the social media management tool Hootsuite so you can automate the posting of this video straight away we're just gonna go ahead and do video and then when it's finished generating the video go ahead and click the download copy link or share icons so if you want to copy this link it'll generate a link and then you can send it to someone or just download it and now you have that video open it up and here you have that video which is fully animated and ready to go then you can come back to the editor save it go into my project and now you've got it there where you can either duplicate it delete it and just go back to it when you're ready to do this sort of video again or if you need to edit it this is how you'll do it script to video go ahead and click start you want to enter some text into it it's even got 
got a spell check for you so it's going to highlight any issues for you go ahead and click proceed and this time let's go ahead and do this portrait mode here and just like previously it's all the same options but in a different format it's still animated all the text found relevant footage and let's say you wanted just to change this footage go into visuals and right here you have all of this footage this one and that will change it for you and then just like previously you would click render you can also customize the editing area in this section here so if you click on settings you can toggle these options here so hide text visual zoom and pan and also audio just by clicking here you can apply it to all or just an individual slide if you want to add a voiceover to this specific section you can upload your voiceover or record it directly Directly here and of course if you want to trim the video click trim and then you're able to trim it slightly like so moving on to feature three which is visuals to video and this is where if you have a bunch of images you want to turn into a video you'll just drag it in so for example I have these images here and once it's all uploaded you can assign tags to each one of these and then click proceed. I'm gonna go ahead and do the one by one square format and you will see all of your scenes at the bottom right here. And again, you can edit each one just by adding some text and you can even change all the styles here, change the scene transitions. And when you're done, go ahead and click the generate button. Final option is for existing videos. So uh, one of the things that's different here is you wanna make sure you change your default language to your uh, region, mine's English UK. Then go ahead and click select the video you want to start adding subtitles to. Another cool feature of Pictory is this notification area. So you can see, you can actually tick a button to say notify by email. And then when it's done, you'll get a notification. And here's that notification right here. And then you can just click go to video and it'll take you to the video. Now this is really cool because what you can see here is that it's automatically transcribed your video for you, which is great for YouTube and all sorts of platforms. And when you click on any word, it's gonna take you to that exact moment in the video as well. If you wanna merge text together, for example, select the text and click merge. If you want to highlight areas, left click on your mouse and drag it all the way to the left like so this will come up and you can say delete from video generate a separate video from it or add to highlights now that's going to be automatically highlighted you can also toggle the remove filler words which will take out any words like uh and stuff like that and you can even customize it by let's say we want to take away the word go so you can see go is there so i'm going to do search for go and replace that with stop and then you can see replace all and now that's been replaced and then customize the max number of lines so here you can see that's now two lines three lines four lines etc but if you don't want to show the subtitles just click the show subtitles toggle button and that will remove it as well you can also download the text ready to upload it onto any platform from the video or you can even generate highlight videos. So as you can see, that's now in preparation and you can also customize the highlight videos as well. So all of the text that was previously highlighted has now been created a separate highlight video, whatever you want. This would be really good for breaking apart on social media or TikTok, etc. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.